This short video is meant to help you make sure you are inclusivity minded in your approach to the application and interview process for student leadership selection. Being inclusivity minded is about making sure you represent yourself in a way that represents your value of diversity and inclusivity to both the application readers and interviewers. Not only this, being inclusivity minded is about making sure you are investigating if a student organization aligns with your value of inclusivity before making a commitment to be a part of that organization. Here are a few tips for both the application and interview process. Let's start with your application. In the application, you'll see that there's a question that asks you to share your pronouns. Many people often assume that someone can tell another person's pronouns by their name or appearance. That's a false assumption. Making assumptions about people's pronouns based on what we think they should be can be hurtful and harmful, especially if we're wrong. That's why it's important for us to ask for pronouns in the application process. We don't wanna misgender you or anyone. In the box, the application, please write the pronouns you use. Some examples are pronouns listed here. Please choose which pronouns and or which combination of pronouns you use and write them in the box. This application will also ask you about your previous leadership experience. We want you to know that previous leadership experience does not just mean previous leadership roles here at UAB. This can include, include previous job positions in retail, food service, or volunteer positions. Make sure to take time to reflect on the valuable skills you've learned from your previous work experiences and be thoughtful about how you translate those experiences to your application for a position. Finally, being a student leader at UAB means that you represent and work for a diverse group of students with diverse needs. Make sure your application reflects your ability to work with a group of students who may be different from you. Find a way to highlight how you respect and honor those differences in your application. Remember what the Blazer Way says, we cherish diversity, embrace, and celebrate all. And you wanna make sure your application shows your commitment to that. A few things to remember about your interview. First, when you introduce yourself, make sure you share your pronouns and add them to your Zoom name. This will help interviewers know two things. One, it will make sure that the interviewers use your correct pronoun and two, it will help the interviewers know that you are committed to inclusivity. Another important point to consider is what to wear. It's important to recognize that we all come from different backgrounds, upbringings, and cultures that tell us different things about what is quote unquote professional. For the interviewers, it's important that you wear something that makes you feel your best and represents you in a way that you wanna be represented, not necessarily the way society tells you that you should be represented. Interviewers are looking for your effort, not a particular outfit. Finally, remember that this is as much an interview for us as it is for you. Assess if your values align with those of the organization by becoming familiar with their purpose and mission and incorporating those values into your questions at the end of the interview. Ask questions about the values that are most important to them and investigate if their commitment aligns with your own. Deciding to dedicate time and energy to a new job or position should not be done casually. Take time to make the right choices about where you want to apply and what positions you should take, should they be offered to you. Thank you so much for your time today and good luck with your application and interview process. Should you have more questions, please email me at cortj at uab.edu. Thanks.